Good morning, Tony. Hey, buddy. I kind of thought about it for a second. Hey, buddy, you ready for breakfast? my vid from this week so I thought I'd get a head start on filming on texting while I'm filming actually hello and welcome to uh did my voice crack okay okay I'm gonna be cash I'm gonna be really cash on this intro I'm gonna be like hey welcome to the vid who cares it's a new video with me How's it going? It's Monday, 6.05 p.m. I just got back from the art supply store. I restocked my acrylic paint because I did some big paintings back there that you can't see at all earlier and realized that I was out of every primary color and black. So I took a little trip to the art supply store and grabbed some new acrylic paint. I haven't had a fresh tube of acrylic paint in years. Every, every time I feel like I talk about anything, it's like, I haven't done this in years, but it just feels like, I guess I don't do anything and unless it's like in year increments. But here's the fresh tubes. The freshest baby paints I've ever seen. Like, <laughs> pretty excited to use them. I did all black today, which was fun. I don't know if it's obvious, but I'm feeling like I don't know how to make art anymore. And I think I've said that in a couple vlogs now. Still running with that. So, um, trying different stuff instead of uh, doing nothing, because that's what I want to do. I want to do nothing. Anyways, welcome to the new vid. <laughs> uh, I picked up the paints that I dropped. I've been filming for four minutes. I haven't said anything. This week, I have a little to-do list. I'm going to do my mini originals for Patreon. I'm looking at my list right there. Um, I need to wait for my stamps to come in for my Patreon envelopes. What else do I wanna do? Oh, I didn't get a package from Moo. I ordered new business cards for my shop update and it never came and I ordered it like a month ago so I need to email them. Ugh, I hate emailing. That's another thing I need to do, emailing. <gasps> Don't like it. I'm gonna get off this intro because <laughs> I'm not saying anything important, so I'll catch you later in the next clip where we're talking one-on-one. -on -one. Hey, I'm driving and vlogging. My camera's definitely gonna fall off there. Can't wait. What's up? I went on a Facebook Marketplace spree last night and I found these stools. They're like probably the stool that you're imagining, but we have all these mismatched stools in our kitchen for our kitchen island. And this is not art related, but it is kind of home reno related. So I'm thinking maybe you guys would be interested. Come on, you're interested. Anyways, I'm going to pick up some stools. My camera's awesome, like this whole setup is sick. So I'm going to pick up five stools and I'm gonna try and fit them in my little hatchback. Um, they're just counter height, so they're not bar stool height, 
my fingers are crossed that they fit, but it's not that far from my house that like it would be detrimental that I didn't fit them all in my car. But I'll keep you updated. I'll show you the before and after of the stools. It's gonna be like a huge transformation and you'll be happy you were along for the ride. Um, also, I'll TTY on my friend. Great news, great news. They fit, they stack. Can you see them now? I'm out of breath. Were these the stools that you pictured? Because they're like the most normal stools, but I really like them. Maybe sometime in the future, when I'm feeling like really ambitious or something, <laughs> I might paint them. But let's be honest, I don't really have time for that. So we're probably not gonna do that. But here we go back home. We're gonna give you a solid before of my current stools, which will be pretty hilarious. Um, you're gonna laugh your butt off and then I'll show you the after. And you're like, whoa, don't even bother redoing the rest of your house. You're good with just the stools. See you there. This is Toadie's neck brace. So he doesn't lick his paws before his allergy medicine kicks in. So don't be concerned. He really likes it. He's a good boy. Here's the before. Yeah, our island isn't completely done. It's just kind of floating there, but these are our current stool. This one's especially nice, huh? Let's switch them. What do we think? Toadie, thoughts? Toadie. What do you think, buddy? What do you think of the stools? They look, um, I don't know. Kind of miss that one. Come on. What do you think? of um, acrylic paint. Maybe it will it will be good. We'll see. Can you see that? Guess we'll see. So it's it's definitely thick, but it's gonna be fine. I could add water to this and it'd probably be perfect. I don't really care how this turns out because it's like the most garbage stool in the world. And it only needs to look good from far away. So I'll probably use it as a plant stand or something. Tody sunbathing. While I'm working on this stool. She's coming along, the paint's working fine. Look at her. I was thinking maybe doing everything white and then doing each rod a different color, primary colors, or I have no freak included. difficult this was because every time I turned around there was another side of the leg or another side of the rods to paint but she's painted pretty thick paint um, probably gonna take a really long time to dry but that just gives me more time to think about what I want to do to it see you stool
time. And it's pretty exciting because Zuko usually hangs out downstairs by himself, but he's kind of been vibing with me and Toadie here. You've been vibing with us. Zuko, you vibing with us? Huh? Huh? So close. You're thinking about it so hard, but you're not going for the hand. Huh. Fine. I just realized I didn't share the final of the stool, so here she is. Um, I do like the colors that I chose. Pretty cute. I really enjoyed painting this guy. Let me show you what it would look like with a plant on it. That's how I'm imagining it. I, I still need to kind of clear coat it. Um, I used it to stand out in my closet and I got it dirty immediately, so. September 25th. Right now I'm setting up to do my mini originals. For the month, I started some at the beginning of the month, but I didn't love how they were turning out, so I'm just, just gonna do all 10 right now, inspired by the paintings back there with just the black acrylic and the still life. So I'm just gonna go with that vibe for these because I really enjoyed making those. So I'm using this like really lightweight craftish paper and just gonna paint some still lives and flowers and stuff with black acrylic paint for my patrons. So hopefully they're, they like that. You never know. So I'm gonna do it and eat these grapes that, this one actually looks really bad. I'm not gonna eat this one. I'm gonna eat this grape and paint. that I'm trying to kind of recreate the vibe for in these mini originals. 
Um, I did enjoy making those and I like the result. Uh, they're fine. But these little ones, it's so hard to recreate the same like looseness and fun in such a small size. I just don't like them. And I'm gonna stop. I am seven in. I usually make 10 a month. We'll see if I can come back to these and maybe add like some color. I added a little bit of red to them and see if uh, I come around. But dude, not enjoying this. I'm cool with making art that I don't like if I enjoy making it, but I'm not enjoying this and I don't like the end result. So it's kind of like, a lose lose. Going more for I enjoy making it and end results whatever is more my goal. It feels more obtainable than having both good as in enjoying it and enjoying the end result. So I have five days to make some mini originals to send out guys. I'm struggling through them this month. We'll get there. We'll get there. Hello. Hey guys, it's Sunday. It's it's my video editing day. That's why I have the glasses on. If anyone's wondering, I don't wear glasses, but I do wear them to edit videos because blue light gives me headaches. Nice. Dude, the last clip where I'm talking about the mini originals I made is really sad. Real sad, huh? I was pissed, for real. Okay, let's let's have a talk about this. I've been getting really frustrated with the art making and I think it's, this is my, my theory. I have the shop update, I have YouTube videos, I have home renovation, and I have Patreon all going and those feel like they have deadlines and priority over making art. So I'm not even thinking about making art ever and when I sit down to do it, I wanna do my other tasks to get them off my to-do list and I don't have a clear mindset or I don't feel like I have the like leisurely time where I can just be relaxed and make art. It's more of like I have to do this and I feel frustrated with how long it takes and how it, like it's not done. I just want it done. I want to cross it off my to-do list. It's not like I'm making art for the joy of it. I'm making art because I want it done. Does that make sense? Um, and that's kind of what I feel like I saw in this last clip we watched together, you and me. I'm gonna try and work on that. I don't know how much progress I'm gonna make because once I open my shop, I'm gonna have less time. <laughs> um, I'm gonna try to maybe do ne better next month with that. I'm not sure how. I don't know, man. I'll let you know if I, f if I figure it out. I'm just, I'm just making stuff up on the spot right now, so I'm gonna think about it and then come back to you maybe another time. If you're in the same position as me, I don't have any advice, but maybe I will sometime. Um, today I'm gonna maybe work on some home reno that I'm maybe going to include in this vid if I'm feeling spicy with filming and editing all tonight. And that's kind of it, guys. I do not have a solid date for my shop update yet. Unfortunately, I still don't know when my prints and my tote bags are going to come. Still shooting for the first week of October, because why not? But I still don't have a concrete date. Sorry about that, babies. So, <laughs> I'm glad I could film this clip so I could not have that sad, mad clip last. If you had a, if you, if you had a, if you, if this video brought you super chill vibes and good times, give her a thumbs up. If she changed your life for the better, hit the subscribe button. You're gonna want to, because there's more where that came from. I don't know, I'm gonna leave it at that. I don't wanna, I don't wanna film that part again, so bye. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Shout out to my patrons. Gotta throw you guys in there. Thank you for supporting me. Super cool, super great. Um, couldn't be here without you. You. I always try the left, and it just doesn't, look at this. Perfect. Look at this. What's she doing? She doesn't know which way she wants to go. Except out of here. See ya.